spinning a wheel. We are spinning a wheel, and and that's that's fun. Apparently, anybody laid any more eggs? No. Good morning, everyone. Dave from the Wee Hours here, back with more 30 games in 30 days. Today with Corral, about chicken farming and eggs and selling eggs and foxes and weeding your yard, apparently. So let's just get a new game started and we'll see what we can do. My, my farmer's name can be my name, because that's fun. And, and I'll remember it easily, because I'm terrible at remembering things. And, and the ranch's name can be the Wee Hours Ranch. No, not the Wee Hours Ranch. That's a completely different ranch in a completely different town. And the Wee Hours Ranch can be like that. Howdy, neighbor. As a welcome gift from your neighbors, here's a subscription for the Farmer's Digest. We hope you'll find it useful. P.D. Shouldn't that be P.S.? Whatever. We've all chipped in and got you a few chicks. Fingers crossed you'll like them. Okay, well, let's go have a chicken farm and see what's happening. Now, this is still early access and early development, and I picked this up because, well, it was a tycoon management style game, and I always liked those, and the reviews for it were fascinating. They basically said, this is a great, fantastic game, but it's incredibly complex, and you really need to spend time studying, and I thought, okay, well, if you're going to do something different with a tycoon management game, I will absolutely get down with that, and then I fired it up, and I just can't figure it out. Apparently, it's too complex for me. Apparently, I am failing at chickens. Let's go through some corral, and we'll see if I get any better at it. There are various kinds of transport crates. You'll receive them every time you order something from the Farmer's Digest. Got it. Okay, weeds will reproduce rapidly and overrun your corral. You can get rid of it by using your trusty machete. Got it. Okay, so my trusty machete. Do I have any weeds? Are there any weeds that I need to be dealing with right now? Nope. Doesn't look like it. All right, let's unpack some chickens. There's a chicken. We got a chicken. Can we do something with the chicken? Okay, stats and chicken cam. We have one hen, average resilience, average size, fairly average beauty, not so smart, but reasonably fertile. Okay, would you like to know more about stats? Well, I kind of went through this the last time I fired it up, so no, I think it's pretty self-explanatory. Corral tabs, the Farmer's Digest tab, will open your catalog where you can buy chickens and structures and food. Barn will show you what you got in your barn, and the market is pretty, again, self-explanatory. Okay, let's open up some more chicken boxes. It's another chicken. It, give me another chicken. There we go. Another chicken. And another chicken. Kind of hoping for a rooster here. Otherwise, this is going to be a very short-lived farm. Now, what do we got in here? Oh, my machete. Okay, I... There we go. I'm macheteing the weeds away from under the box. Yep, yep, machete, machete, machete. The box is kind of in the way right now. That That's okay. We're going to weed the farm with a machete. A weed whacker might be more efficient, but you know what? If I've got a machete, I'm going to use a machete. All right, let's see what's in the box. What do we got? We have a placing structures tutorial. Excellent. Manual generator. Okay, so we got to have electricity. Fine. I, I get that. That makes sense on a farm. Cranking it repeatedly, it will store energy up to its max capacity, but it will also lose it with time. Oh, hang on, hang on. There, there's a truck. I, I got to go get the mail or something. Okay, we'll, we'll figure that out. All right, and, and E places the structure. Got it. Well, we should probably place this somewhere. Uh, that seems like a good place as any. Now, I... I can't get off my farm. I, I actually can't get off my farm. Apparently, I can't jump this fence. Nuke the whales for Jesus. Okay, great fan. What do you actually do for a living? You are old, reliable, best deals in all of history. Okay, what, what do you do? A surprise parcel? And I, I need to order that for 300C, which is apparently my currency. All right, I don't really have that kind of money right now. I have 900, and there's going to be some other things I'm probably going to have to buy. Oh, hang on, hang on. More weeds. More weeds. Come on, get rid of the weeds. There we go. All right, what's in? Live plants inside. Okay. You can buy plants or seeded pots. Crops can be mixed using a food processor, and pellet mixes can be made with two crops and one optional extra nutrient. All right, so we got to figure out what we're going to feed our chickens and and I'm sure that's going to affect their productivity. Uh, hen, oh, we got a rooster. Oh, good. Good, because otherwise it's going to be a very, very short-lived farm if we don't have any breeding going on. And what do you do for a living? Ah, you seem like a water trough kind of thing. Let's just go 
put that over here. That seems a sensible spot for that. And I suppose we should probably crank up the generator. Yup. Okay. And, and we just do this a bunch, do we? All right, fair enough. It, it's not, I mean, spinning a wheel is, is part of a game, I guess. Sure. Okay. Now, do we have any eggs yet? Have you? Oh, you have an egg. Okay, there's an egg. I'm going to go get this egg. Got an egg. All right, we have one egg. Oh, and more eggs. Okay, you give me your egg, and you give me your egg. All right, can I? Oh, and more eggs. All right, eggs are happening. Eggs are happening. Perhaps faster than I imagined. You, rooster, should probably go, you know, do your thing. All right, what else do we do around here? Well, I was going to buy some stuff, but apparently it's getting dark. Darkness attracts dangerous predators. Without any lighting at nighttime, predators are much more likely to raid my corral. That sounds terrible. Should order a lighting solution from the Farmer's Digest. All right, I was just going to buy some stuff. Also buy an early warning system. Okay, well, give me a light then. That, that looks like a light. Wooden lamppost. Staple in rural, rural areas. This is 400C. I only have 900. Are there any cheaper lamps? No, that's 500, and I'm assuming, like, any market in any game, the further I go down, the more things cost. What do you do? Carbon fiber wind turbine. That sounds handy. I should get one of those at some point, and probably one of these gasoline generators. Those are pretty cheap, too. But let's start with the most immediate thing, like a lamppost. Okay, order that. Order that, and escape out of that. Now, does that just... When, when does that arrive? Does, does that arrive at some point? Do, do, I, do I get my lamp... Or do I just have to stand here watching my chickens in the dark? Because I'm gonna tell you, that's um, that that's less than less than fun. And P.S. There's no way to speed up the game. I I would just be standing here watching my chickens in the dark. When does my thing arrive in the mail? Can we get one of those drones to drop it off? Okay, I got my thing. I just wasn't pressing the button correctly. Let's open up my thing. Yeah, give me. Oh, it has to unbolt and everything. There we go. All right, now we're talking. Let's go put that near the electricity. That seems sensible. Okay, well, we've got a little bit of light, not enough energy. Okay, I'll go, I'll go spin the wheel. I'll go spin the wheel. Hang on, hang on. All right, spin, spin the wheel. I got to get one of these gas generators. This, this just ain't going to cut it. Um, okay, I got the light on. I've got the light on. Yay. Spinning a wheel. We are spinning a wheel. And, and that's, that's fun, apparently. Anybody laid any more eggs? No? Okay. Can, can I sell my eggs? Is there anything I can sell? You know, to like, yeah, I want to do egg trading, please. I would like to do egg trading. I would like to trade eggs for money. I have, I have nothing. Well, what happened to the eggs I bought? Or got out of the chicken resting areas? Chicken nest? I should get like a coop. That seems like things chickens like. But apparently I don't have any eggs. Even though I clearly got some eggs. Do they auto-sell? Am I... Am, well, I was going to say, am I misunderstanding the mechanics? But the obvious answer to that question is yes. Because ain't nobody tuning into the wee hours for competent gameplay. There's probably people who, for whom Corral is the greatest game on the planet. And they're probably screaming at me right, right now. I should probably keep turning the wheel. Yeah, keep keep turning the wheel. This is really critical, apparently. Otherwise, foxes will eat my chickens. Let's buy some more stuff. That, that seems good. Let's get a coop. Coop seems good. Chickens like to live places. So we can get a DIY chicken coop. That's 200C. Or a coop deluxe for 500. Well, how much money do I have right now? It's all blurry down here. It would probably be handy if I could actually see how much money I have while I'm buying stuff. Because I can do that in the real world. If I go to the store, I can open up my wallet and see how much money I have before I try and purchase something. Let's just go with the DIY chicken coop. We'll order that. Okay, did, did we get it? Because this is the button to do the I want this thing, please. Yeah, there it is. Okay, super. It got delivered. Excellent. Give me... Open up the box. Okay, give me... Um, why, why can't I place it there? Really? I can't place it there? Are you serious? Okay, I can place it over here, apparently. All right, somebody go live in the chicken coop. I bought you one house for, like, five chickens. Um, why are you all... Why are, why why do you have a little heart symbol over you, rooster? 
Oh, actually, that's that's probably pretty self-explanatory why the rooster has a heart symbol in a corral full of hens. I'm, I'm sure he's rather amorous at this point. He's got all the hens to himself. And I notice our plants are growing. So that's good, right? That that should be a positive thing. I should probably spin the wheel again. Spin the wheel, spin the wheel, spin the wheel, spin the wheel. Okay. Can I get one of those gas generators yet? Or maybe I should just probably buy another light. Probably another light. And nobody's laying... Oh, are you laying an egg? Okay, good. Good. I, I think I need eggs. I mean, the game is about chickens. I don't know where my eggs are going. I'm picking them up and they're... They're not apparently available for sale. Maybe I'm just holding them in my pocket. Well, I'm making progress. I figured out the point of the manual generator and spinning the wheel on the manual generator. And what it is, is it gives you something to do while literally nothing else is happening and you can't speed up the game. It just gives you something to occupy your time, just spin the wheel a little bit while the chickens sit on their nests. Ostensibly laying eggs, but... I've seen no evidence of that. It's been a full game day and it has produced no eggs. And now I see the point of, of doing the weeds with the machete. It, it gives you something to do while literally nothing else is happening in this game. I, I'm struggling to see the, you know, reviews of most complex, interesting farm management game. I, I guess... I, I guess it's a philosophical complexity, perhaps? Maybe we see the futility of life and the inevitable doom of death in this and we stand around kind of just whacking things with a machete and turning a wheel. I think there is something deeply philosophical about just turning a wheel while nothing else is happening and I, I feel- Oh, we got an egg! We got an egg! My, philo my philosophical discussion is over. We've got an egg! I- I- I, I can't- Oh wait, that's a- that's a chick! We- we got a chick! Okay, good. That that seems really positive. I kind of prefer the egg, truth be told, because I, I, I don't seem to be able to generate any income unless you chickens pr start producing some eggs. So we got a different chick. That's back to spinning the wheel. Okay, spinning the wheel. We are spinning, spinning the wheel. This has become Jean-Paul Sartre-esque at this point. This is a Kafka-esque level of gameplay. We, we are spinning a wheel until something happens. Well, I was gonna buy another lamp because I figured that would be fun and it would illuminate the farm a little bit at night, which doesn't move any faster than it does right now. This is the fastest the game will move. But I can't afford another lamp because that's 400C and I only have 320. And I don't seem to have any viable way of producing income. I've weeded out what I can weed out at this point, and I, I just got really, really tired of whacking weeds with a machete. I, I don't, I don't get it. I'm, I'm just gonna spin the wheel some more, and, and maybe that, maybe, maybe something will happen. No, we're just gonna spin the wheel. I can't escape from this Kafka-esque nightmare of chickens. Although, we do have lots more chickens, so, you know, the rooster is doing his thing. And I guess we all appreciate that. I I don't get it. You know what, guys? I don't get it. If you understand this game and can tell me why this is fun, please let me know in the comments. Seriously. If you are the world's best, greatest corral player and can tell me what exactly about this is enjoyable and fun, please let me know. I would desperately like to know what's going on here because all I'm seeing is spinning the wheel, and clucking. That's that's my takeaway from this game. So if you get it, if you understand Corral, if you think this is the world's greatest farm management tycoon-y kind of game, let me know. But otherwise, I don't think we're going to be seeing Corral on the wee hours anymore. Until then, I'm Dave. Thank you, as always, for joining me in the wee hours, and we'll see you next time. Anyone want to get the head out of the hot tub? Did you want to maybe pull this head out of the hot tub? That's not sanitary, guys. That is not okay. That's a health code violation in the mansion.